putting of this dns okay so here's this other ticket from d and says printer dns it says remote laser printer not recognizing dns address now why you would want to use a dns address with a printer doesn't make much sense to me dns stands for the main name system um, or some people say the main name service and what that does is wait maybe you mean remote laser printer not recognizing dns address you mean like the host name if that's the case because what dns does is um here let me give you an example i'm going to open up a notepad and i'm going to do this printer name which is also known as the host name or a computer name whatever it is a computer is a computer a printer in this case is also a, a computer so printer name whatever the name of the printer is and dns translates it to this something like this or it could be any ip address that you set it to so it takes the name of the printer and it changes it to the IP address. So I'm assuming, I'm assuming here that D is asking about that. And remote laser printer not recognizing DNS address. And I'm assuming you're referring to the host name or the printer name that is assigned to the printer itself. In this case, if it's not, if there is a DNS issue, there could be a DNS issue within your company. It takes time if it's a brand new printer it takes time to replicate over the network for the dns uh, server to you know realize that oh yeah so this printer name is actually at this ip address so what it does is instead of you having to remember the ip address of the printer or any computer you just need a printer name so whenever you're configuring a printer when you're adding a printer you just type in the name and it finds it you don't have to remember the ip address and that's what DNS does for you. So you don't have to type in the address. DNS does that for you. If it's not working, then obvious bypass is to use is to use just the IP address to configure it. This will bypass the DNS. So you don't have to use the DNS server in any way. So what I suggest for you is to use the IP address directly and configure it like that. So I'm just going to add a reply to this because this is more of a question and you will get the questions and help us. Just a question. You can say, hello, you can use the IP address to bypass the DNS server. So in this case, we're talking to somebody who knows what DNS is, right? We're talking to somebody who's an IT person. If it was just a user, you don't you don't want to be technical in any way. You just say it's fixed fixed printer, and you know, and that's that. You know, you can use the IP address. You can use the IP address to bypass the DNS server. You can use the printer's IP address to bypass to bypass the DNS server. Because in this case, I'm assuming the DNS does not know where the printer is located meaning what its ip address is and i'm going to close it thank you very much for submitting these tickets d i really appreciate it